Is this north of Dayton? Peak of Ohio. In fact, I live not too far away from where the actual peak is. Which is kind of funny to me because it's like, you look towards the peak and it really isn't that impressive. Thank you for coming on such short notice. My stay in Exalting Sanctum was supposed to be focused on treating people and delivering mm. medicine. I've already concocted some of the medicine in question. Mm. No problem. Thank you. This is the medicine. Okay. Take it to the person in question. Alrighty. Delivery! I don't believe in progress. In oh, wait. I had to go this way to go down. My quest marker is down. Downwards. So that's good. Alrighty. Continue on. My goodness. Is this the one Don Shu sent me to find? Aw, little Miss Lady can't see ahead. Can't see right, can't see left. Heads to the east. Ends up west. <laughs> you guys are horrible. <laughs> hey, what you looking at, Outworld? <laughs> What's with the little kid be? Is having a, having a teenager's voice. Good wordy. I swear they mismatch the voice actors sometimes in these games. Stop it. This got to do with you. You were family or something? Cause you don't look like it. Hmm. You're just trying to be a hero. The Lafu Trio, huh? Enough of this nonsense. Get away. You are. Yeah, get lost. <laughs> oh, good lord. The kid punches me and he's the one that falls down. Force! Uh, stop yelling and help me up already. You're already on your feet, I arrogant kid. That's right. If you have you sure about that, Bart? No, <laughs> shut up. I'll let you off the Yeah. Ah, good word. Kids these days, huh? I swear they were just like that when I was younger. <sighs> wow, twenty four eighty five. Good morning. Helping me, miss. Hey, no problem. Are you okay? It's my fault. I shouldn't have wandered off on my own. Then I wouldn't have run into those guys. And they always laugh at me for being blind. And they like to trip me up and steal my things. It's not your fault. <laughs> Thank goodness you were here. Otherwise, they wouldn't have let me off. Hey, Corpse. So I'm doing good. Good to see you. Uh, let's see, 2500 $12.50, oh, my goodness. Oh, Sue asked you to come. Things are bad on the law field recently. <laughs> Can't stay long, but I wanted to say oh, hi and have a good day. Hey, thanks, I appreciate it. I do. Well, I've delivered the medicine. I should report back to Don Shu. Yeah. Dang, the, this collar is giving me issues today. Um, if you guys aren't aware, I've got some sort. I've got um, some sensory issues thanks to the. Uh, basically, the way I I was born. And certain fabrics tend to How drive me absolutely Did nuts. Deliver the medicine? And uh, the stitching on this collar is giving me an absolute fit. <laughs> she reminds me of myself when I was a child. I also had to find my way in the dark, face obstacles I couldn't predict, as well as deal with unconscious prejudices people had against me. Right, if me I was too. Never injured by bullies or after a fall. 
I'd run crying to the healers at the Alchemy Commission and ask them to heal me. Hmm. I suppose that's why I followed in their footsteps. To pay a little kindness forward. Oh. Thank you for looking after the child. Could I ask you for another favor, friend? Sure. What do you I need? I want to meet the little girl. I worry about her wandering around on her own. Mm -hmm. And I want to... Her parents passed away in the denizens of Abundance Wars. Oof. The healer's medicine might remedy one's physical health. But sometimes, the loneliness and hurt inside one's heart needs companionship and care to heal. She I told see. me that whenever she's feeling troubled, she finds a quiet corner in the Artisanship Commission and just sits there. Her parents used to be <laughs> artisans in the Commission, so I think she has some nostalgic oh. connection to the place. In all likelihood, so that's where she'll be. <sighs> all right. Let's go find the kid. And make her the happiest kid ever. What's happening? Dang it. Is oh no. Trouble? Yep. <laughs> you guys need to leave this kid alone. You're horrible. Horrible monster is picking on a little child. Shame on you. Shame on you. It's all right. <laughs> Thank you, big sister. Thank you, don't you? You don't need oh, to be scared anymore. The second little She's kid that called scared. me big sister. But I when I think about all the trouble I've caused you to. Is that why you're crying? Oh. Because in the next few centuries. So, if a little bit of guilt like this is enough to break your heart, then how will you manage such an arduous path? Is this supposed to be comforting, Don Chi? I'm not trying to con walking alone in the darkness, fearing every incoming, invisible obstacle. Oof. Unable to understand Dang. other people's descriptions. Kid, everyone who hurt you, <laughs> everything is like a hot coal in the dark, invisible. It's still able to burn you. Able yeah, to yeah, burn yeah, 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 yeah. As a Oof. long life species, she can expect life to continue like this for nearly a thousand years. She must learn to depend upon herself rather than just foolishly waiting around for the next hero to swoop in. There will always be someone willing to help her. One hopes that would be the case. But that would require someone to be by her side every, every waking, waking second, second of, of every day. day. Yeah. You're right. Good. This place is too dangerous. Let's head back to Exalting Sanctum. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it's Thank it's a again. hard lesson to learn, but sometimes. Well, done. It would seem we incomplete ones are often bullied from a tender age. Mm. I endured in numerous hardships. Incomplete to ones. Chief well, you're not incomplete. Yet. You might be different, but you're perfectly fine. By leave me feeling helpless. That's ah. the reason I said what I said. You might mistake my words for being hurtful. Ah. But the truth Gosh. is... Is there no cure? For long life species, these things are permanent. Mm. Whether we are beautiful hey, or... Hey, J-Dog, good ugly, to see you, good to be here. Tall or short, wise or foolish. The impairments of short life species can be corrected with ingenia or surgery. But that's an impossibility for us. No matter the method employed, how our bodies will eventually return to their original states. Really? I too was once a non-believer. 
I fooled myself into a quiet... That brief window of sight that I regained has turned into a mm. perpetual source of anguish. Oof. For long life species, this incompleteness is a permanent, unavoidable tenance. <laughs> Oof. What a joke. Mm. Even the denizens. What do you mean? It's nothing. Thank you for sticking. Oh. Mm. I see you soon. Jeez. That's another reason why being Im being immortal is a bad idea. If you end up impaired, you end up impaired and ex I mean exiled to some degree. I mean, we're getting better with accepting people with impairments and with disabilities, but I'm sure if someone stuck around Wait, long enough, so you're still reading traditional it wouldn't be as easy. Moving on already. Web novels are the way forward. <laughs> I don't like to read some books to pass the time. <laughs> Mr. C.E.N. said that making bookworms feel at home is more important than getting them to buy some. All we ask <laughs> is that you find a quiet spot. Ooh. Yeah, I'm passing the time. Wait a minute. How can she use the, the messaging system when... Sure, I'll buy it. I'll buy a book next time. Wait, wait. So you're <laughs> an unsuitable job for a puppet. One, two, and three. Okay, I'll tell you what. I'm gonna buy every book in this store just because I love reading the lore and later on. Just call me the TikTok version of Mad Pat. The lore! I need to know about the lore! <laughs> you know, I could always see about doing a, a, a lore video series here on TikTok. <laughs> oh, good lordy. <laughs> or is it good lordy? <laughs> oh, good gosh, I'm a nerd. I mean... I'm a dork, a nerd, and an... <laughs> oh, good lord. Oh, boy. The ambrosial arbor. Ah, there you You've been running so many <laughs> errors. Examining the exhibits in the seat of divine foresight <laughs> inspired me to create this. I referenced some historical texts and... Concoct I call mm. it the Broomdew Concentrate Palette. Ooh, and nice. I like you. Consuming it will make your body light. Well then, that's that. Perhaps the next time we meet, I'll be able to see you in the true mm. sense of the word. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Swallow it down. Hmm. Wait a minute. <laughs> Something's wrong. I'm burning oh, up. Oh no. It feels like I can't breathe. Oh great. I'm being <sighs> Mara struck. Seems to be calming down. This doesn't seem right. Oh great. Yeah, it looks like I was tricked by another member of the Medicus. <laughs> Something or other. Right. Uh, there goes my head again. Is Don Shu sure this brute? What's happening? Isn't this the seat of divine? F no, I can't. Oh no! But it's not Mara Shrek. Rules are made to be broken. 
You won't get away. <laughs> I love that. Now my five stars are really powerful. The preservation is powerful. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Come on, let's go. I need to be broken. Almost there. Excellent. Uh, what happened to you? Careful. Don't hurt her. Hey, wake up. Oof. Are you okay? Thank the stars. You what came to me? the seat of divine foresight. And... I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I don't remember anything at all. like you'd lost control. There has to be something. Oh, no. Right. Tell me what. Oh, great. So the medicine was a poison. From what you're saying, it seems like the gift she gave to you must be related to the disciples of the healer who examined you just now said your body to could Don Shu be playing a trick on you? Or is her medicine somehow not mm. working as planned? My advice is to come back later hey, Bob, for another good to see you. Will the it's thrill. It's disciples of Sanctus Medicus Good to see you. All, good to be here. Who knows what healing effects mm -hmm. it may have. I'll put out a wanted notice for Don Shake this D-Ting with you. Hmm. Ooh, another D-Ting. I love it. I love the, the cute little puppy. All righty. <clears throat> Shu isn't here. I've got it. Don Shu's medicine box has her scent. Alrighty. The artisanship commission. Oh my. Okay. All the way there, huh? Time to come out, little Deeding. Come on, let's follow Don Shu and go get her. That's Don Shu with a group of disciples. I guess, I guess that, that tells, tells me all I need to know. to know. What are you doing here? Master, stand back. Let me handle this. Stand mm. down. She's a friend. Mm. Many of our brethren have fallen by her hands. Yes, I am a friend. Mm. I said she's my friend. Leave us. Leave us. Okay. Yes. I didn't expect you to come looking for me. They call you Master. You're the head of the disciples? The head? What a crude way of putting it. I am Master of the Disciples of Sanctus Medicus. Scion of Merciful Medicus. Mm. And I shall leave. Did you ingest the Broomdew Concentrate pellet I gave you? Did yeah. you feel the shift? So many mm. elixir seekers arrive on the Sienjo in the hope of obtaining the formula to immortality. But none have succeeded. Their aspirations are well founded. Mm. The Sienjo does upon ingesting the Broomdew Concentrate pellet. You will feel the limitless freedom of the form bestowed upon you by merciful <sighs> Medicus. And yet, <sighs> you don't sound any different. Why is that? I host a Stellaron inside a Stellaron? me. Stellaron? That's impossible. Even if <laughs> what you say is true. To host a Stellaron as a short life species would only sp friend. <laughs> Please, I urge you to leave the Lafu. 
abandon the struggle. The truth isn't what it appears to be. All I see is that you're what turning people into monsters. What at the seat of divine foresight tell you about this conflict? That the mm. Rainbow Arbiter is the emissary of the righteous? Yeah. That the Arbiter is <laughs> chasing the heathen plague's author across the stars? While the disciples of Sanctus yeah, Medicus good abet to see their you. heresy. Do you really think that is the case? So one of the things that I like about this game is just how it makes you think the devilish about the different author, things that are going on. And me. honestly, how there could be real-world implications of the same lines of thought, honestly. I mean, I do not ask there are a lot of people that are... Um, I just wish for you to leave the law maybe not maybe not seeking immortality but they're definitely seeking this to isn't your fight subvert the natural order of things i mean we have a lot of people that are working toward making medicine that um mm, should i let her go should i battle should i let her i'll let her go Since neither of us is eager to engage in combat, <laughs> let us respectfully part ways. But, you know, there are people out there that I are making, thinking. designing drugs and medicine to try and prolong a benevolent God. our health or Nor is optimize our health and stuff like that. I mean, yes, there's medicine that's good, there's medicine that is actually helpful, but then there's medicine that just does nothing but keeps you hooked on whatever it is. Had you known um, me first? Perhaps I was hooked on meds from the time I was eight years old Master, because they they diagnosed me with ADD and then they gave me pills I sincerely to make me normal. This will be our last meeting. Yeah, so. Farewell. Hey, Gavin, how you doing nameless. tonight? Good to see you. Farewell, nameless. Hey, good to see you. Good to be seen. I'd better report my findings to Ching Zhu at the seat of Divine Fortune. A seat of divine foresight. Sure, let's go. <laughs> mm. Gotta go, but I love you. Hey, I love you too, man. It's getting late. Where to now? Where else? To the seat of divine foresight. How did it go? I report everything to her. So you weren't able to apprehend her. I see. These people once again. Thank you for all your help. Jing Yuan tells me you'll be joining the forces mm -hmm. led by the Alchemy Commission and Master Diviner. I won't take up any more of your time. If you yeah. run into Don Shu again, Contact the nearest Cloud Knights. Oh, I will. Take this as a token of my... Yay! Stellar Jade. Alrighty. So that's all of the... ones that I wouldn't be able to get otherwise. Do I have enough for another poll? Yes, I do. Let's see. I want to see my details. I want to see when my last four star was. Ah, just a couple of pulls ago. Okay, so I, should, I shouldn't be getting another four star, but I could get another five star. Let's see. Standard star rail pass. Yes. And, ooh, I can get three. I mean, sorry, Hook. I would get you, but I'm probably going to end up pulling you on the, on the standard banner anyway at some point. Come on. 
Three star? Okay, fine. Another three star? Okay. And another three star? Okay. One more! Come on, give me a four star or a five star. Yep, another three star. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> Alrighty. Back to the main quest line. Man, I've always I've already been streaming for an Master hour and divide. thirty minutes. Back. Nice. I have kept you waiting, but the deceit of the disciples is laid bare to me now. Yep. Why didn't you tell us about the disciples earlier? Apologies. To avoid dissemination of intelligence, the General and I kept the involvement of the Disciples to ourselves. It is a clandestine organization that seeks to overthrow the Alliance. Before the Stellaron disaster, the Disciples have remained veiled in shadow for years. Their emergence reflects their intricate connection to this calamity. Right, the conflict see. is difficult, Master Diviner, but you have led your forces from the front lines and beyond in pursuit of the enemy. Admirable work. Come on. All right. Hardly. Let's get the right angle A diviner on this must map. acquire first hand knowledge in order to calculate the future. There we go. Collecting intelligence in this way assists me in achieving the right answer. Wait. What's all this about a difficult conflict? The disciples of Sanctus Medicus have been scheming for a long time, but our army is in no way inferior. How can things be so difficult? This is a segue into us joining the fray. Just ask for our help already. Come on. <laughs> Gotta go get some sleep. Hope you have a great night. Thanks for the life. Hey, no problem. It would seem you came prepared. Yep, I did. The first time we met Madame Yukong, she said something like, This is a Sienjo affair, and there's no need for the Express to get involved. Oh, thank you and so now, much for the. We are running around doing everything. man, I appreciate Even it so IPC much. The takes it easier on us. <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! <laughs> what are we up to this time? Oh Could my it gosh! Be heading to the front lines, leading the Cloud Knight charge. That is well, so awesome! Thank you so much. Nope. Try this on for oh. <gasps> So there. Oh my gosh! Thank you so much. Who said you'd be heading to the? Oh my gosh! Where else would I be going? Uh, we're not? Jim nope. Yuen's orders. He said that the value of unexpected <laughs> guests lies in the unexpected. The Cloud Knight, please. Come with me. Okay, I'll come with you. Where are we going? After receiving the Ambrosial Arbor, the Alchemy Commission was once the Law Fu's most vital commission. Mm hmm. After all, it was Ooh, they the who the Sienjo natives and. But in the end, the alchemist grew discontented and began to obsess over the manipulation of life. Mm. Research into the arbor poisoned their minds. The more they pursued it. Morning bells chime in a dream. Evening mist gathers around me. Do you see that? Yes. What is what it? Huge elixir crucibles. There's still smoke coming out of them. This is where the alchemists practiced the way of immortality in ancient times. They erected elixir crucibles here to absorb the power of the arbor, turning fantasy into reality. Mm. Since the smoke from the crucibles never ceases, this place was named Eve Mist Mansion. I see. An elegant name, 
But as far as the art of war is concerned, it's a death trap. You have a good night, bomb as can do. As long as the crucibles are lit and the smoke continues to linger, we cannot hey, get Hey, Sean Dawson, good to see you tonight. This is why the Cloud Knights lost control and became Mora struck? Mm. Indeed. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus infuse the smoke that permeates this delve with medicinal pellets that elicit Mara. Unless the Cloud Knights were able to march with their breath held, they would be doomed to fall into disarray. Moreover, no one can know whether their comrade was about to be stricken with Mara. Is there anything better than fear for destroying hey, the Hey, thanks for sharing the live, man. The Cloud Knights' first assault for was the just a cover. You're using the main army to attract the enemy's attention, while we douse the elixir crucibles and stop the smoke. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus renounced their century of secrecy and chose to reveal themselves, meaning they feel confident of victory. But no matter how well prepared they may be, their focus has always been the Cloud Knights. They are completely unaware of your existence and capacity. And in short, cannot be prepared against you. Ooh. The smoke can't, can't affect us. Why not try to get the Foxians and Bidiotera to try? You misunderstand the nature of the Marastra condition. It is not a curse unique to humankind. Foxians don't usually succumb to it because their lifespan is not eternal. Yet they are still a long-life species. The Vidyatara mm. rely on molting to discard the old world. Mm. All long-life species are equal in the face of Mara. However, the disciples of Sanctus Medicus could never have guessed that the General would seek outside help. Mm. They won't be prepared against short-life species. I see. And is this what General... I wouldn't hazard a guess. All I can say is that the predictions of the Stellaron Hunters were more accurate than mine. Yeah. The future that Kafka seeks is becoming reality. One, One step, step at a time. At a time. I don't want to act according to their predictions. Come on. I do not wish to be their puppet either. In any case, we do not walk alone and unhindered on our paths. Our choices define us and influence others. Mm -hmm. The duty of the Master Diviner is to bring luck and avoid misfortune. I don't want my choice to plunge the Lothra into a terrible future. Um, so, the gray-haired girl... Hand, um, only you can douse the Elixir Crucibles without being harmed by them. This Let's girl see. here, the gray-haired girl, uh, fine. is I didn't hear a please, the main character. Seeing as we do and basically, we go through the entire here. game Mr. Yang, seeking answers as to where we come from because we have no memories. I will come what we're doing and dissipates. You um, won't be what the um, what the group called the Stellaron Hunters are doing and what they're after. Um, it's basically kind of like Genshin Impact in a way. Um, you can kind of, I guess, make the connections in a way. <gasps> what? You seem quite You're all right. So far from the elixir crucibles. <laughs> <laughs> Even so, okay, I admit. <laughs> you better return to the home Out front. The question. Jing Yuan gave me authority over the cloud. Is that no really Did safe, though? <clears throat> if I told you I wasn't certain, would you turn back on the spot? It's a free-to-play game from Hoyaverse, the same ones that make make Genshin Impact. Nonsense! Though I'm the healer's <laughs> belief after centuries, do you understand now? Short life species heal. No, you. St blah blah blah. I'm I'm gonna leave you to it. Just share the live, like the like the stream, and then if you have a couple of couple of coins, maybe throw them my way in the form of a gift. But that's it. I, I just appreciate you being here, man.
I do. Huh. I feel like even though long life species get to live forever, they aren't so different from us short life species when it yep. comes to worries and suffering. Oh, definitely not. Definitely not so different at all. <laughs> there we go. Wait, Miss Ting Yoon! Why are you still here? You're too close to the crucible! Thank you for the concern, but I'm fine. The general commanded me to stay with you. I dare not go against the I'm playing orders. on PC. Your life for the is PS5 more controller of all things. Go back. We Actually, this to the um general. This controller was a gift from a friend. He had it customized and everything, and then let me have it. It's actually pretty darn awesome. I don't know that there's an inscription on it. Let me see. Nope. No inscription any or anything on it. Um, anyway, I'm using a... Hey, thanks for the gifts, man. I appreciate it. Um, I'm using a... There's really no need. I've spent my years traveling the universe. Our, Not to mention, I'm younger and stronger than I look. RTX 2060 Ti. And a actors have probably lived longer than me. Ryzen 6 2600X for the um, CPU. Hey, thanks for the thanks for the gifts. I appreciate it, guys. I do, I do. You're all amazing. I wish I could figure out a way to make this smaller. So it'd fit in the chat box area that I got set up on my overlay, but that don't have to work. Hey, thanks for the chill, man. I appreciate you. Oh no, this is this my new game? No. Um, I don't have a new game actually, specifically. Um. Seems like the smoke is getting thinner. Not thin enough. We need to hurry. The game that I made was, um, done quite a while ago. Hey, thanks. I hope you have a good day, too, man. I appreciate you. Have a good one. God bless you. That'll take more than medicine. There we go. And then... Five. You won't get away. Yes, this excellent. <laughs> Let's make it quick. Excellent. Broken. Oh wait, I got it down auto battle One when I didn't. Closer to the stars. There it is. The yes. But no, to answer your question, Mitch, it's not my new game. Are made to be broken. Um, that's better. My new game is linked on my profile, but it's already done, so it's just my game. I never actually made as much of it as I wanted to, but I made as much as I could. I'm not that great at game development, honestly. Oh no. Uh, to turn it off. How did I turn it on? I don't know. Because I thought I should. Maybe. Burn away. Yes. The wheel forged in ice. Never falters. <laughs> Good job. Zapard. Yeah. Oh. Ouch. Rules. 
Yes. Excellent. Good job. And then turn you off. Burn away. Good job. The username guy, good to see you. We'll forge an ice. Never falters. Mm -hmm. So, I'm probably going to be streaming for another hour and 20 minutes. And that's about it. Oh, yes. Achievements, which mean more stellar jade. Yay. <laughs> Assignments. Claim and then dispatch again. Oh, yeah. Hope all is well, friend. Hey, how you doing, Trafalgar in law? <laughs> Snail fan, good to see you. Hey, Jesse, thanks for the follow. I appreciate it. Oh, really? Now I can do four. Awesome. Okay, so what should I do? Mm. Metal. Character materials. Oh, that'll be good. I can get... There we go. Excellent. Good to see you. Good to see you. I'm definitely going to have to go through a lot of these messages off stream. <laughs> Alrighty, next one. Crap. Hey, thank you for the Monopoly Go. I appreciate it. Unimportant. The inevitable is already upon us. Oh my. What do you I'm mean sure. by that? It's you. Hmm. I have met you before in my capacity as <clears throat> chief alchemist, master diviner. You don't, you seem, don't surprised. seem surprised. Indeed. The general and I knew that the disciples of Sanctus Medicus must be hiding in the Alchemy Commission. However, hmm. without evidence, we couldn't. And now, your charges are many. Drawing Stellaron spirits into the Sienjo. Resurrecting the Ambrosial Arbor. Striking hmm. down our people with Mara. The Ten Lords Commission will address these transgressions during your reckoning. Oof. Crimes? If I am guilty, then all of our Sienjo <laughs> ancestors are also guilty. Oof. They were the ones who accepted the blessings of the abundance and turned their descendants into long life species. The disciples mm. of Sanctus Medicus are only walking on the road our air in days of old. The roots of the Ambrosial Arbor enveloped the Sienjo Lafu like a living creature. We controlled the stellar seas, and none could stand in our way. Mm. Everyone could become celestial and shift form at will. Divine miracles descended onto all nine Sanjo ships. What a glorious time that was. Wow. How far the Sanjo has fallen. We consent to be commanded 
by the devilish archer. Oh yeah, it's so definitely fun. There's a lot of, uh, of great lore, but the also there's a lot of great just game point. Um, it's kind of like Hon Honkai, except it's turn-based battles. So it's pretty fun. I do not blame you for your... <laughs> Then again, I remember the days Forgive when I would play Final Fantasy. Profound enlightenment. Final Yours Fantasy 4, Final Fantasy 7, Final Fantasy 10, give up on their Final Fantasy 9 later on. All we're seeing Joe ancestors fought side by side with the Arbiter, laid waste mm -hmm. to the Arbor, and established the Ten Lords Commission to lay down the lines between life and death. Mm. In doing so, we enshrined our future as human beings. Human beings, Celestials? Yep. There are no Celestials on the Sea and Joe. The divine miracles of the Abundance, the manipulation of life and death. Your deeds are nothing but evil. True. I have nothing to say to you, True. Master Diviner. You have already made your decision. You have discarded power. A most foolish choice. Foolish? Nah. I don't think so. Master Diviner, allow me to show you what the Celestials were capable of. Sure, why not? Yeah. Alrighty. I have something for you. <laughs> yes. This ends here. Oh, I've been playing this about uh, eight weeks now, nine weeks. Pretty much since it came out. Isn't that all? Let's make it quick. There we go. Yes. Rules are made to be broken. Excellent. Yes. Oh. Hear my call, sir. Oh, thank you for the follow, barbecue. Oh. One the heck? Oh no! I don't have de debuffs. Something for you. Okay. Hope you're prepared. Yeah, let's go. Ouch. Hi. Just in time. Just a little something. <laughs> Much better. One man. Oh crap. Child. You have Time for an overhaul. Crap. Uh. This ends here. Perhaps you still don't understand. Humanity never conceals its desire to be yes. and I am no exception. Oh. In the name of Landau, a will forged in ice, never falters! Shield! To my heart's content! Good. Yes. I'm fresh shot. That's fine. I need to heal. That's better. You have my gratitude. There we go. Yes, this will be good. Just in time. Just a little something. Think nothing of it. Much obliged. Let's go. Oh yeah, there we go. Great. You won't get away. Yes. That'll take more than medicine. <laughs> I have something for you. 
Yes. Be prepared. Good, good, okay. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Alright, kill you off. Now, get you started. This ends here. Perhaps you still don't understand. Yes. 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 She said, who said? The ambrosial arbor's descent will bring us undying bodies. Hmm. The one who gave us the Stellaron said that. Who gave you the Stellaron? Pantelia. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus have fulfilled our promise. Pantelia. You, Lord Ravager, must do the same. Now, quickly. What? Little pawn, must you force what? me to intervene directly? What? I'm loath to flout my philosophy of destruction. King Yun, what the heck are you up to? Never mind. It would seem the time has come for other means of dismantling the Xianzhou from within. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Aren't your eyes supposed to not be that color? What in that? Were you replaced at one point? <sighs> what a shame. What are you doing? Uh, it would have been nice to observe for a little longer. <laughs> you received the gift of abundance. Holy crap, she just died to reintroduce myself. I am Lord Ravager Oh I have the single purpose. To set in motion the self-destruction of the Sienjo. Oh god. Uh. Is the Lord Ravager of the Antimatter Legion? But uh, how can that be? Because she's a keep calm, all of you. This is a formidable no. enemy. We have to stay together. Forge to us. Never falter! I'm gonna be lucky if I can survive this battle. Gonna be lucky. I have something for you. <laughs> yeah, there we go. You won't get away. Excellent. This is our chance. Yeah, there we go. Oh. Here we go. Break. Time for an overhaul. And... <laughs> Good job. Let's make it quick. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Two of three. Okay. Oh, here we go. This works. Are made to be broken. But no, I've been playing this game, like I said, for about nine weeks. Or however long it's been since the game release. <laughs> hasn't been too long. Yeah. 
Since that stubborn general of yours has forced me to take center stage, I'll make sure I steal the show. Sure. <laughs> My apologies for leaving so soon. But I have an appointment to keep. I'm sure my friends here will be happy to entertain you. Sure, I guess they will. And I'm no exception. Yes. Okay. Come on, Himiko. All right. It's hard. Let's make it quick. Yes. Naughty child. Yeah. Come on. For an overhaul. This end here. All right. Impair him. Ouch. <laughs> Just in time. Just a little something. Nothing. <laughs> okay. Rules are made to be broken. Yeah. And then another. Time for a shot. Then another break. It's here. Let's go. Yeah. Break him. You won't get away. Yes. Come on. I'm almost done with you. Come on. In the name of Landau, we'll forge an ice. <laughs> Never falter. Shielded. Perhaps you still can manage to see as its desire to control the heavens. God bless. Hey, you too, man. You heading out? Okay, if you are, I appreciate you being here. Wait, uh, wait hold on a second. Are you really saying that Miss Ting Yun was a member of the Antimatter Legion all along? And what was that fire that came out of her? And her body? Where did it go? Hmm. Mr. Yang, you're smart. What happened just now? Hmm. Mr. Yang? <sighs> The flame we witnessed claimed to be Lord Ravager Fantilia, a name I've heard other nameless speak of in the past. Oof, dang. Ugh, my back is killing me. I need to have it arrested. <laughs> She's one of seven Lord Ravagers who serve Nanook and finds pleasure in witnessing the self-destruction of mortals. She's led countless souls down a dark and hopeless path. Mm. Meaning that Ting Yun had long since fallen under the Lord Ravager's influence? Mm. I don't believe so. Fantilia revels in watching a corrupted mind eating away its host from inside out until the obliteration of both is achieved. Mm. But there was no indication that Ting Yun had been misguided or manipulated. It's possible that the Ting Yun we knew wasn't her true self, but an image Fantilia devised hey, how to you doing? serve Good to her see you purposes. Evangelibert? Oh, I love it. Or Evangelibert, yeah. Randolph. How you doing? You're saying that I'm sorry, March. I can't say with any certainty where the real Ting Yun may be, or at what point she was replaced by the imposter. Hmm. Without at this point it's all just conjecture and hope. But hmm. if that body belonged to the real Ting Yun, it does raise the question of why Fantilia would go to such lengths to destroy any evidence of her. Mm. I believe this to be Fantilia's goal. To sow seeds of seeds doubt of among doubt. us. And it's clear that the sudden resurgence of the Disciples of Sanctus Medicus is all connected to the Lord Ravager. 
Ventilia is aiming for the Ambrosial Arbor. If she succeeds, the Lulfu will be deprived of its roots, making its destruction all too easy. My goodness. We need to take a star skiff to scale Gorge Waterscape. The Ambrosial Arbor can be sealed from that cell. Okay. Let's make haste. Yay!